Jack Marcus, a well-known concentration camp survivor, died this week here in Milwaukee. His funeral was this morning, but his lessons will live on forever because he dedicated his life to telling the story of the Holocaust. He disappeared before he came to Auschwitz. When today's TMJ4 interviewed Jack Marcus two years ago, the Holocaust survivor's recollections were fading. But the memory of his parents and even of the long-faded prisoner number tattooed on his arm remained crystal clear. 144, 346. Marcus died Tuesday, but he leaves a legacy of teaching, sharing tales of the concentration camps he survived. As bad as they were, they were good compared to, to the other. He told his harrowing story to countless generations of students, including his own son, now a leadership professor at Harvard University. Dad would say that your job is to make sure this never happens again. Jack Marcus didn't water down the details of what he'd endured because his fear remained all too real. The fact is, he did have PTSD throughout his life. And perhaps the worst part was he was afraid till the last day that the Nazis would find him and get him and kill him. But Dr. Leonard Marcus says despite his fear, his father remained committed to his own resilience, and that resilience was stronger than the fear. And Jack Marcus was a successful Milwaukee tailor. It was after his retirement that he began speaking at schools about the Holocaust. Jack Marcus was 93 years old.